Hello everyone, today we have a review of just brand new updated uh, software for Xiaomi Mi 10T Pro which is MIUI 13.05, the latest version based on Android 12 and today's uh, 4th of June it just came to my phone and I have Chinese based version but it's localized from Xiaomi U so it supports much more uh, yeah, we'll just zoom a bit. So it supports much more languages than regular MIUI 13. So basically that's it. That's here, MIUI 13.05 stable version by Xiaomi U. So just let's go briefly one by one what we have here. And let's see. So basically here we already see a RAM extension. So it's 8 plus 3. So 8 gigabytes of RAM plus 3 gigabytes of RAM. I have a phone version for 256 gigabytes and 8 gigabytes of RAM. Uh, Alright, Android. Android still Android 12. And with this update it came the security update. So security update from uh, 1st of June, the latest one. And Google Play update from 1st of May, so also uh, the latest version for now. Uh, okay, let's move on. Let's just go briefly through the settings and see what's the difference. I think those one we will skip. There is nothing special, only Wi-Fi maybe. You have Wi-Fi assistant. Uh, this one came from MIUI 12.5. It's traffic mode, so you, look, you can allocate your bandwidth to apps and background downloads. And also you have a smart network acceleration, so you can use mobile data to boost the speed or use dual band Wi-Fi speed boost, so you can connect to 5 megahertz and 2.4 megahertz at the same time uh, okay so for this point I think that's it uh, let's move on to wallpapers uh, so here we have library uh, super wallpapers uh, so basically it's still the same no updates with this one this geometry was added with MIUI 12.5 uh, here also still uh, all the same, maybe added some here, landing points. It was added also in MIUI 12.5. Oh, with here they don't have any points and with snow peak also nothing. With home also they have landing points uh, that were added one more with MIUI 12.5. And this design of this wallpaper and personalization point is also uh, adjusted from MIUI 12.5. But basically it's still uh, the same. Maybe some new wallpapers came from MIUI 13. Like here, system wallpapers. So you have uh, like brand new that are quite nice looking, let's say. Yeah, so you can download them. And it will be in form of uh, animation, form of video. Also you have crystallization. Here is the same. Mm, okay, you cannot open it now. You need to enable Wi-Fi. So it's also quite nice wallpapers that came. Uh, from the new SMUI 13. All right, what else? Uh, from lock screen, nothing special as I remember. Side panel shortcuts, so charging animation, still everything the same, so will not focus my attention here. Uh, display, uh, dark mode options, same. A refresh rate, so here nothing special, sound and touch, so that one touch came from uh, MIUI 12.5, you can feel how your uh, sensor works, like haptic feedback sensor, uh, so you can select the level and you can feel with your hands how it will feel like, so basically it's also quite good to check, so you can see and uh, check it out uh, by yourself. Also, you have notification control center, still control center, same as MIUI 12.5, but they uh, promised to update it he with the sound here and brightness here. Maybe you saw it on some other pictures, but for now it's still uh, from MIUI 12.5. And of course, you can switch to oldest version. Also, you have smart home here you can select. And by default now it's saying the playback, so it's showing to you what's playing right now, whether it's YouTube or music or some other multimedia app. So you can control uh, play or start or change the track or change the video from here. And as always by default it's not possible to hide it even. And also it's more or less like on iPhone where you can select 
aware to cast uh, your uh, like AirPlay on iPhone. So Xiaomi create a similar one. So where you cast your source, let's say. All right, uh, home screen, same settings. Uh, you can just hide some app icons that was also not available in previous versions. So it's also quite convenient. Uh, don't show text also appeared and uh, others are still the same uh, Safety emergency will skip privacy protection also battery. So here now you can control the mode So you have sub uh, save battery mode balance mode and performance mode uh, so it's showing that uh, overheating issues and consumption do you see change in color from orange to green to blue also have ultra battery saving and battery life more or less still the same. Optimized charging appeared in MIUI 1305, also quite nice feature. So it's reduced battery again. MIUI learns from your daily charging routine in order to reduce the necessary continuous charging. So this function also came from iPhone, from Apple devices that are implemented around one year ago. Now it's in MIUI 13 supported, so and by default it will be turned on. So also quite uh, quite nice feature to have maybe something change in the settings. Um, all right, here is nothing special. Uh, apps, um, nothing here. Additional settings. Uh, LED light, one hand mode, clear speaker, memory extension. Yes, it already descri described to you. So it will increase your memory by 20%. So you have eight gigabytes of uh, memory. So it was increased by uh, three, maybe even 30%, yeah, by 3 gigabytes of RAM. So now I have 11 in total, which is quite good. Also, accessibility, nothing special here. You can select region, was not, also not available before. Um, special features, yes, this one here, it's appeared uh, sidebar. So you have such nice animation and always show. So as you see from here, I don't know whether it's visibly uh, clear. Here you have like sidebar and you can enable all the time and you have the apps here. You can add the apps uh, up to you and it will be always in all the apps shown by default. You can choose the position left, right. And if you disable it, so it means that it will be only enabled while playing video or some games. So you can select exact apps which you need to to have this one or just always show if you want to have access to this touch bar all the time so that's also up to your preferences let's say but it's appeared in new MIUI 13 uh, MIUI lab that's all old ones so basically basically that's uh, all the changes that is available now also some widgets here uh, maybe something new okay not that much actually nothing special uh, the widgets here are um, new in MIUI 13, so in previous version uh, it wasn't there. So now you have uh, so many widgets inside, of course, mainly of them for Chinese market, for uh, Chinese users, but still you have some default like App Vault or Mi Gallery Memories or security apps so basically some apps are international and it's uh, supported quite well like battery for example quite convenient to have here yeah. uh, COVID-19 some something for China so basically that's uh, based on Chinese version so that's why it has a bit more features uh, if you have a global one comparing to that one uh, but basically for now as I see, not much differences here comparing to MIUI 12.5. Basically, they added Android, although they added some features like memory extension, they added features like uh, smart charging, like this toolbar, they should update uh, uh, the control center a bit later, so looking forward to it. And I think that's it what I wanted to show to you to this update MIUI 1305. I think once I get new update, I will definitely make a new video and you will see maybe they will change something or add something special. So that's it for this one and hope you enjoy watching. If you have some questions to me or how to install the MIUI 13 I have on my channel. Also, if you want to some comparison with MIUI 12 or 11 even, so also leave your comments below. And if you have some questions when 
your uh, your phone will get an update i already posted separate video so i think i will uh, keep it here like this and you can just watch this video and know when your phone will get the update so basically that's it for this video thank you very much for watching and see you next time